All right, guys. So today, Do Man on XDA forums um, made a post where we have HUSPA available on AT&T phones. So we're talking about some uh, way faster speeds, especially on uploads. Uh, of course, it's going to depend on you know availability for your location. But let's go ahead and run through a little uh, quick tutorial on how to install that. So, um, if you don't know where to get the RSD Lite program, I will have a link in my description for that. Um, or you can watch my previous video on how to root and put ROM on your Motorola Atrix. I'll have a link for that too right here on the screen. So make sure you click on that if you uh, want to run through that. But this is only showing you how to do your... Uh, your radio and you don't really have to even root or uh, put ROM on your phone for this so, so you can do it straight out of your custom or off your stock firmware I meant to say um, so we want to start with uh, taking out your SIM card and your SD card and we're going to put the battery in and then you're going to hold the volume up key while you press in and hold the power key your volume up right there hold that in and now Hold in the power button until you see RSD on the top of the screen. Okay, starting RSD protocol support. That's good. So now we're going to hook up our USB into our device like so. Okay, that's connected. Go ahead, download this file for Mega Upload. Uh, the link's here on the screen really can't read it too well from my phone that I'm using to record with but uh, go ahead download that extract the zip files onto your desktop I got a little bit of my design here that I'm working on um, so here we are at t Radio 187 it's basically what we're putting on there so now we're going to start up our RSD Lite sometime today there we are now I'm gonna browse that file on my desktop it says I'm connected on the phone through USB uh, port number one yeah yeah okay cool now I'm gonna select my AT&T radio file open click the start button waiting for re-enumeration and just let this go through its whole process it's gonna restart your phone it's gonna go all the way through um, some people may get a prompt that says manually restart your phone where you are going to want to again pull the battery on your phone and put it back into that RSD service mode um, sometimes it won't give people that uh, that error or not an error but a message and that message will show up on your status area here if that is something that you need to do otherwise it will uh, turn green here and it's a success so let that run and you guys now are on your HSU PA oh yeah so leave some comments let me know if it works for you or not and of course all the links for this uh, are in the description thank you for watching